you guys are about to see what is about to happen. The moment, and I mean, the moment I open up this garage. Because, um, remember my last video, um, where I explained, um, how the tape didn't, s how it didn't stick on long enough for it to bounce? Well, we'll see if it does it this time. Because I would like to get this captured on camera for you guys. So you guys will see what I mean about how this thing bounces, so... Let's see. So we're gonna find out in three, two, one. See, it did it this time. It did it. It didn't do it that much. Yeah, see, that's becoming a little problem. But the tape, at least. Oh, darn, forgot to close this thing in my last video. Um. Anyway, um. This tape, at least, is a. Uh, Keeping the bouncing to a minimum, because without the tape, this thing would bounce horribly. <sighs> Alright, I finally got it on camera. This is also for Dad, because he wanted to get this on camera too. To, um, to show a good friend of ours who installed this for us to replace the Liftmaster. So anyway, well Chamberlain, looks like I finally um, got the door to bounce. Oh, did you? Yeah, it just, the tape... Just the, the thing did not stick on long enough, so. But yeah, it stuck on long enough for it to bounce a little bit. But hey, you do a good job of keeping the, well, the tape does a good job. You don't really affect anything. You're just, you just make it open, but. Anyway, yeah. So yep, that, that is what happened right there. It bounced because it stuck on long enough. So I waited for about an hour after my last video. This is on the same day, so. Because I did my house update video. Anyway. Well, so that's what happened. So let's just go ahead and close this thing. Before it gets too hot. See, it acts normal when it closes. Well, Dad, I was finally able to get this on camera for you. So you need to see this. So anyways, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. Um, be sure to leave a like and subscribe and that'll be it.